Hey guys, this is TNN and today we are going to review the ASUS ZenBook 3, the world's most prestigious laptop. So here it is, it's the Asus UX390U and it's the Asus ZenBook 3 and the colour that we got over here is well called by Asus the Sophisticated Quartz Grey colour that's what they call it anyway, I'm just going to call it grey um, so this was sent to me by AO.com um, AO.com is actually a really good website, the user interface is absolutely amazing, customer service is great as well I actually ordered this on a Friday and it came the next day, like literally like within 24 hours, maybe even just below 24 hours, it came the next day on Saturday and the delivery man was really really great, polite, great delivery service, it was well packed as well um, AO.com is basically a website where you can buy loads and loads of household appliances like washing machines, ovens, microwaves, other technologies like computers, gadgets, so many things you've got on there, uh, TVs as well. So link to AO.com will be down below in the description, link to buy this laptop will be down below in the description as well. Um, that's pretty much it from uh, where I got it from and all that. And this is claimed to be the world's most prestigious laptop by Asus. So, let's go ahead and let's get on with this review. Here with this USB Type-C charging cable, um, it's not really the longest cable out there, but it gets the job done and does charge your laptop within about two hours. And you do get about seven hours battery life as well. So you can see over here, USB Type-C is now reversible and that is mainly the charging cable that uh, most companies use now. So it came with this adapter. Now it comes with an adapter because the only port that this laptop has is a USB Type-C 3.1 and a microphone and headphone jack port. It has no other ports, so no USB 2.0, no HDMI. So it comes with this adapter, so you can actually add another USB, a HDMI and another USB Type-C. So it's really, really cool that it comes with adapter and it doesn't have those other ports because the laptop is just so thin. If you want to check out what else the laptop came with, go ahead and check out the unboxing video. I will link it down below in the description. Now this laptop is 12 millimeters thick, so that's 1.2 centimeters of thickness, and you can definitely see that it's a very, very thin laptop, and it's probably up there in the top world's thinnest laptops up there with the top big boys like the Apple MacBook and all that. So it's doing really, really well. We got two uh, LED indicators over here uh, indicating energy saving or if the battery is charging, and we got the USB Type C 3.1 port over there. We got this lovely, lovely anodized goldfish over here. So what this is. It's basically a two-stage anodized edging, so it's gold finish look with aerospace grade alloy finish on top over here. So that is what Asus are calling these finishes. So definitely, definitely a premium finish, and it looks really, really prestige, just like Asus say. On the left side over here, we have the 3.5 millimeter headphone and microphone jack, so it's a two-in-one. And basically, you can only use one at a time, so you can either use headphone or you can either use uh, microphone or you can get an adapter so you can use two at one go. On the back over here we got this, some speakers over here, we got four rubber pads and just some window signs and some legal information and we also got really nice screws over here as well so um, the fan inside of here is actually claimed to be one of the thinnest fans in the world as well so that's really really good, really really nice design they've gone for over there. Let's go ahead and open up the laptop and have a look at inside. So you can see over here we have the high precision glass touchpad and on the top corner over here is the fingerprint scanner. Yes, the laptop comes with a fingerprint scanner to unlock and lock your computer. How great is that and really, really good security on that as well. The screen is very reflective and in fact you can see the tripod and the shirt but it is a 12.5 inch full HD 1920 by 1080 pixel screen and absolutely stunning and we'll have a look at that in just a sec as well. On top of the screen you can see a really really small dot over there that is a VGA front webcam camera. Not the best quality camera I have to say but I doubt you're really going to be using it for much webcam but they could have improved the camera quality on that. 
We do have a full size backlit keyboard and again just a really really nice keyboard with chrome finish on top so it just suits everything and all the design as well, very very nice keyboard. Inside the laptop we do have an Intel Core i5-7200U CPU and that is a dual core CPU clocked at 2.5 GHz but it can get up to 3.1 GHz, that's a pretty powerful CPU. We have four speakers located on here, so it's a quad speaker here, here and two underneath as well and another two on the side over here. Now this is a, the quad speaker surround sound by Harman Kardon, so again amazing sound quality. Uh, we've got the power switch over here, let's go ahead and just press that down. We'll get a little LED light over there indicating that it's powered on and there we go, we've got ASUS in search of incredible. Now um, it does power up very very quickly, just a few seconds. Go ahead and pop my finger on the touchpad and it will unlock, so there you go. Unlock, simple as that. Um, there was a little bit of dirt on my finger so it didn't lock properly but if we try that again you can see the speed that it does unlock it in so it's very very fast and it closes very elegantly as well the hinges on the device is very very all elegant so let's try it one more time there and there you go look how fast it unlocks so very very good energy and you can see over here the viewing angles on this screen is absolutely stunning as well we get the same colour on all different angles very very beautiful screen um, again it is 1920 by 1080 pixels so it's a full HD screen great great resolution um, so we came pre-installed with a few apps case over here so we had uh, Microsoft Edge pre-installed of course the Microsoft Store we also came with Avar security as well so it, give, it gives you the option to download Avar security and all this really really good and we also got a Asus gift box as well which is sort of a um, it's an installed device on here and it lets you have applications for free or discounted prices so that's really really good as well so you know it just improves your uh, laptop and the performance as well so that's very very nice um, we came with Evernote and some other applications installed as well so we've got iCare switcher over here if you double click on that it does dim the screen a little bit and shades the colour off a little bit as well so if you're using the device at night you do get a really nice eye colour and it doesn't strain your eye either. Um, we also got web storage as well, the device does come with free web storage, that's online cloud service by Asus as well, so that's absolutely amazing. Um, basically what this is, is basically the look and design of a MacBook, but inside is a Windows computer. So if you're a fan of the looks of the MacBook, but you're not really the fan of Mac OS or the user interface on Mac, then this is the laptop for you and it definitely is one of the Mac killers so inside this laptop over here we do have a we just went for the CPU really nice CPU uh, the graphics processor is the Intel HD graphics 620 we've got 8 gigabytes of LP DDR3 RAM inside of here and 512 gigabytes of SSD so that's more than enough memory for many many things um, the laptop is mainly designed for basic use such as maybe Photoshop um, browsing, Word, PowerPoint, business use, uh, Excel, things like that really is mainly what it was designed for. And we can go ahead and go on YouTube and we'll put on a video over here of one of ours, one of my own videos, and you can check out the quality from that as well. Hey guys, so here's one of my videos from before, and you can see the camera quality and the really, really nice quality, so it's pretty volume on Max, and we've got amazing surround sound on this laptop so really really loud and crisp sound I can tell you that so you can hear over here absolutely nice um, if you put on some music as well now the battery life on this thing did last me up to a good five or six hours but of course look it says over here one hour 27 minutes so this is full brightness and uh, not really heavy usage but when you do use it quite a lot on full brightness it does do that so it will last you about a good three hours on full brightness but if you put the brightness down put on battery saver the battery could last you up to seven hours which is pretty good for such a thin laptop and it only takes about a couple of hours to charge as well now the display on this laptop is beautiful as you can see I've turned off all the lights and you can see over here even in dark lighting the display is very very stunning very even in highlighting the display is still vivid and very clear and very bright so that's a very, very good thumbs up on this device over here now another thing I really like about this device is the full backlit keyboard so what does that mean basically if you hold FN down 
and you go ahead and put on the brightness up and the keyboard literally lights up so I'm not sure if you can see this right now but if I turn off my lighting then you should be able to see it so let me just go switch off my lighting and there you go we do have a full backlit keyboard so if you're typing at night or in dark areas you can fully see your keyboard nice and clear and that is a great thumbs up as well that is an amazing feature and it looks absolutely stunning as well now I don't want to drag this video out too long but the last thing I want to show you guys is the benchmark test on here so let's go ahead and get up the results for that so this was a small benchmark test I did on Nova Bench and the score was 692 so you can see over here that we had 8 gigabytes of RAM using 1.2 uh, gigabytes of megabit speed as well so that's very very good um, we've got the Intel Core i5 7200U at 2.5 gigahertz um, currently it's actually clocked at 2.7 gigahertz so when you get the laptop people will be clocked at 2.7 gigahertz um, the graphics test it scored 91 uh, it did get 3D frames per second 289 frames per second so that's really really good and the hardware test score was 31 and again it did a drive speed of 67 megabits per second and the drive in here is 476 gigabytes of memory that was on here of course it's actually 512 gigabyte SSD but you're not going to get the full storage uh, on there but that is really really good benchmark test I'll tell you that and this laptop is probably a MacBook killer I mean it's the nearest one that could get to killing a MacBook so if you're a MacBook fan but you don't like you know Mac OS this is the laptop for you this is the ultimate ultimate nearest laptop you get that's Windows and so close to MacBook so that's what's really really good about this laptop um, other than that it is very very thin it's so ergonomically designed very lightweight I think it weighs only 910 grams so it is definitely under 1 kg of weight so it's super super light and what more can you ask for a very very prestige laptop very beautiful very stunning and it really gets the job done um, the display is very good as well it even works outside in the sun and high high lighting basically even then you can still see the display very vivid and very clear um, it's very small very compact and the laptop also comes with a carry case as well so it comes with this carry case so you can go carrying it around as well and it is also a stamped carry case so overall score I give this laptop has to be a very very high score it's going to be 9 out of 10 it is beautiful beautiful laptop it really really is powerful uh, very small very lightweight very thin what more can you ask for from a laptop um, the only thing I didn't really like is the use of these these adapters over here now this can be very annoying um, you do have to carry this around so if you ever do want to plug in a USB or a HDMI port another USB C port you're gonna to have to use this adapter and it basically just fits in like so and then you get the ability to plug in your USB uh, dongles or whatever you've got over there now that can be quite annoying but they had to do the sacrifice in order to make the laptop really thin and lightweight which is understandable and that's it really overall score 9 out of 10 great laptop great display great sound quality what more can you ask for from a laptop very powerful laptop as well and it could definitely kill the macbook so link to buy this will be down below in the description as always thanks for watching this review and if you want any more videos you want me to do for this laptop do just comment down below and i will get them done i'll try my best to read as many comments as i can as well